Hey everybody, we're back, and uh, we are out to find the Melham man here. The mighty hammer of smithing. And um, this is like goblin country right here, so I guess... I don't know if I missed this in the story so far, but I think the goblins are... They're either taken over by... They're not goblins, they're grobbles? What the fuck? They're grobbles. Oh, we reached level 14, you guys know what that means. It's epic helmet time. It seems like the either the grobbles came out of the rift gates, or they are like degenerate natives that have been taken over over by the ethereals. That looks good. Look at the rare offhand. Four crit damage. Is it better than ours? Look at that, it's plus two to Dreek's evil eye. That's the skill we add in the beginning that we respec out of. Plus 24 poison damage. That is That would have been nice for uh, for the beginning beginner build that we had. Let's put on this. What the fuck? Man, that is pissing me off. That thing gives us plus... What? Oh, it's physique. It gives us plus 13 physique. Let's put some in physique. Still doesn't help us with our chest. Let's just put on this one. Fuck it. Fuck it. Anything else we can't use? Oh, look at that. We've got like red, red rally stripes. That would give us physique. Maybe we have to use those components. Maybe. Okay, let's try this. So let's see if it actually, if we have to use it. Berserk item. It does. That's interesting. I'm gonna use it in our next. What's the cooldown? Does it say? Am I blind? 12 second duration. Okay, well, let's just use it in our next fight or whatever. Hey guys, okay, let's go. I used Berserk. Dropped our frames. We take a lot more damage. What the fuck? Stop shooting at me. Still recharging. I don't know what the cooldown is. It looks like minutes, maybe? Maybe a minute and a half. Oh, oh, look at that. They're like right in the... That's like a bottleneck of death right there. That was cool. The seal spawned and they all got caught up in it. And then the slow spell and my plague. Just a bunch of... A bunch of death. And again, oh wow, now the spiders are coming from the side. Look how all the, the goblins just withered away in that bottleneck. They have like a lot of HP though. Which doctor? My energy is low. Holy shit. But I'm asking, oh, come on. The game is getting a little tougher. I've heard uh, people say that the game is not that easy. Um, let's see, do we have anything here that we want to keep? Oh, that's that one. That's the uh, poison staff. I wanted to level up. Um, let's go with Shaman. So the main attack is a dot as well? I didn't even notice that. That's weird. How many points do we have? Three. Let's put three in those. I wish there was like a confirm button. Can we level anything here? Can't. Alright. Mellow man here. Where are you? So let me try this. Is this a bleed as well? 
barely see those. Okay, that's... Let's try... Let's run away. That's funny. Let's try this. Come on. Let's try full full stack bleed on this guy. Okay. Ticks for 20... That's pretty good. 26? 18? So when our stacks go down, we, it's like a dynamic thing. See, now it would be like over 20 again. Yeah, it's 26. And when our stacks go down... That's interesting. But what I'm interested in is we've got three stacks now. Okay, let's try with a different enemy. Let's just kill this dude. Okay, nothing, nothing here. Why is there nothing here? I would have at least thought there would be some kind of boss here, but there isn't. I'm still not sure if our main attack actually synergizes with our other bleeding attacks. Kind of drives me mad. Oh, okay, so that was a champion. We could try it with him. Let's just kill this guy, okay? Okay. Fucking die. Okay, now we've got six stacks. Let's put the dot on him. 119, 128, 128, 51. Okay, that's better stacks. Run out and let's dot him again. 28, 103. Yeah, it does stack. Definitely does stack. It was like 103. That's interesting. So I think our priority should be getting the stacks up and then casting the dot. Like this. You have to keep firing because it's like dynamic. Holy shit! Is that like a boss in there I didn't see? Oh yeah, it is. Ooh. He's like hiding behind that tree. Let's get rid of those bitches. Holy shit, you son of a bitch. You're gonna die. That thing is like instant. Let's put it on our berserk hat. No. Holy shit. Okay. That was disappointing. 11 spirits. It doesn't have movement speed though. It does have spirit. Let's just take it. I don't know if that movement speed is so noticeable. These areas are like really large. Holy oh, shit, oh, you guys. Okay. Damn! Like, if we have full stacks, and then use our little dot, it's like, major overkill. Because it just hits like so... What the f***ing eye? Is that Angram? Okay, it takes one dynamite to clear. Okay, maybe these are like shortcuts, in my guess. Like, so we don't have to go through any caves again that we've been in, or whatever. Like, the ancient waterway. Alright. Alright. Let's go up here. Check it out. It look, looks like a new area. Oh, it's Burwich Village. Let's secure, let's do the main quest. Let's secure the gate. I mean, we are here, so why not? Stairs down. I don't want to go down any stairs in this place. 
can we get out of here? We can't. We can't. Is that a door? No, it's a cupboard. So I guess we have to go around. It's weird. Your design choice. Hey guys. Oh, cultist orders. Cultists? What the fuck? Brothers of the blood. The ethereal presence in Burbage grows stronger with each passing day. We are shifting our operations beyond the city limits where we may proceed with our plans undisturbed. Our focus now turns upon the Devil's Crossing, where our newest agent and Dyrony has successfully sabotaged their water pump. Soon that irksome group will be forced to flee their sanctuary, and then they shall be at our mercy. Ready yourselves, brothers, soon we shall drink the, their blood. The ethereal presence in Burbage grows stronger with each passing day. We are shifting our operations beyond the city limits. Does that mean that the cult and the ethereal are enemies too? So we have like three opposing parties? Or are the ethereals... Support... Uh, the, is the cult supporting the ethereals? There is the rift gate. Alright, let's go. Let's battle. Let's stack up. Let's stack up. Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, man. If we stack up and plague, we're golden. Let's keep our stacks up. More enemies. Hey, guys. Yeah, that is, that is a lot of damage. I like that. Oh, there's a boss. Holy shit. It doesn't... It doesn't take that much, though. Let's kite him through the shit. That was nice. Nice. Is that all the loot we got? Are you kidding me? Oh no, there's a thing right here. Okay, it's all very underwhelming, the loot. Fuck, there's so much to do in this place. Those pants are definitely better, but we can't wear them because they're heavy pants. <laughs> Void touched mutant arm of alacrity. Alacrity, alacricity, whatever. Get anything good? No guns. Found the rift gate, which is cool. That skill's not ready. Smoke him out. Musty tome of oh. Fuck! It's it's again. It's elemental damage. I have the feeling elemental damage is something that always comes in tomes. But it had more spirit, so I'm gonna use it. it. Doesn't make sense, kind of. So let's explore this place a little bit more. See if there's anything. Anything interesting. Or a seal of. I didn't even use my Berserk skill. That makes me kind of sad. In the last fight. The last fight was kind of easy. The boss fight. Can't do that yet. So I'm not that sad. Well, so far I'm kind of enjoying the lore. It seems to be... It seems to be a little more gritty. And a little more realistic, maybe. It's not so high fantasy. Fuck this place. Oh, I like how the seal spawned right under the ether crystal. I already, I already forgot what these ether crystals do. I knew there were, there were four. Maybe unlocking the shrines or something. 
I don't remember. Okay, let's go down there. See what we have here. Flooded cellar. Okay, maybe there is a, a boss in here. I would appreciate that. That's a huge cellar. Hey guys. That was a waste of plague. Chipped claw. I like how it's like thematic. Kill beasts, you get claws. You can't get through here? Okay. That's weird. What do we have to do to get through there? Hmm. <laughs> I don't know. Guess there's nothing we can do. We need dynamite out of some weird mine that we've never heard of. Retcher. Holy shit, there's somebody throwing bombs. Oh wow. There are a lot of enemies here. Look at my plague. Look at my plague. The more enemies, the deadlier it gets. I have the feeling. Like, the more enemies that show up, the faster everything spreads and the more damage goes around. Okay, what? Okay. I thought we couldn't go in. That's another flooded cellar. Holy shit. I don't know how happy I am with this spell right here, Devouring Swarm. It is good, but... I don't know. It doesn't feel that good to use it. Ooh, wow. Twitchy motherfuckers. Hey. Ah, uh, no match for me. Now we're on the other, other side the cellar that we were just inside of. I have the feeling that this build might have problems later on in terms of single, single target damage maybe. We have to see. We have to see about that. Well, there's a lot of loot in there. That's a huge cellar. Hey. Hoping for, for a boss fight here. To be honest. Because those are so, so fun. Rickety ladder. Let's check out the rest of this place before we go back up. I think that's what we're supposed to do. Inventory is almost full as well. And I think I'm going to end the part after we finish exploring this place. And that's going to end my play session for the day. Recorded like four or three or four parts. Okay, that's it. That's kind of lame. So I won't end the recording session. I'll go up that ladder and see if there's anything special there. Because this did not end on a high note. This place down here. It is kind of boring. Some connected cellars with some minor mobs in them. Find one shot chests. Okay, those are explodey guys. Gotta watch those. That effect is really cool. 
because it, it sets off like a chain reaction. Hey, what the fuck what are you doing in here? All by yourself. That seal, even though it seems kind of minor, it, it is pretty powerful. What the fuck? They have from they like put nets on me and I can't move. Oh, it spread the plague. Fuck everybody up. Almost everybody, everybody dies really quickly. Love that so much. Like, when I... Uh, said in the beginning that I was craving an action RPG. What I was actually craving was uh, I don't know if I talked about this. What I was actually craving was um, Something like the uh, witch, not witch doctor, something like the warlock in uh, World of Warcraft Like dotting enemies and I thought about playing Diablo, but it's not really that possible in Diablo You have the witch doctor, but I hate playing the witch doctor. I uh, played one to max level in the last season, like, I don't know, two months ago or whatever. The presence farm required and you dwells within this place. I think that sounds very interesting. They're 20, level 21? Got worm the man-eater? We are gonna take him on. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. No fear of gut worm. It's probably a killer ass. Kick. Kick our ass. Okay, we don't need any of that. All right. Gut worm. Ooh, gut worm. I'm leaving. Well, he should stop doing that charge attack. Holy shit. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. We've got a personal rift. Ah. <sighs> Okay, maybe we should wait another two, three levels before we fight. Have you found a rift gate in Berwich? What's the situation out there? It's swarming with ethereal corruption, but the rift gate is secure. Good work. While you were gone, I dug through some of the files in this office, and I think we have our target. As you are acutely aware, ethereals can possess humans and bend them to their will. I always had my suspicions, but now I have little doubt. The former warden of this prison is possessed. Well before the Grim Dawn, in fact. Uh, yeah, yeah, we, 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 uh, we read that, didn't we? There are like gruesome, brutal things going on here in this prison. There have been countless holes in the prison records. Prisoners just disappearing, never to be seen again. The warden's personal logs paint a more complete picture. He's been transferring prisoners into a secret facility underneath his mansion in Burwich Village for years. What for, I don't know, but... I'm sure it wasn't for rehabilitation. There are also several mentions of ethereals and rift gates. I need you to find this man, or whatever he has become. Where can I find him? Warden Krieg owned a mansion in the northern district of Burwich Village. The logs indicate that his facilities can be reached via the cellar. I'm afraid I don't have more to go on, but if we want to strike back at the ethereal power structure in the region, the Warden is our prime target. I will end the warden's life. Okay, that's interesting. I like how it all connects. So here we have Dureni. Dureni. He is the uh, occultist agent. Let's talk him. Talk to him. Let's talk him. What do you want? You look to start problems. Best be on your way. I found a curious note in Burwich that mentions you by name. Uh. I, uh, wouldn't believe anything it says. It's slander. Explain yourself. Now I know this doesn't look good for me, but hold that weapon of yours in check a second. Uh, mm. Yes, I sabotaged... Oops. Yes, I sabotaged the water pump, but I had my reasons. You see, I was a prisoner here back when this place still served as an actual prison. When the world went down the slith hole, I stayed here with a few others. It was the safest place I could think of. Clearly, Bourbon thought the same when he showed up with the rest of the survivors. Things escalated quickly. 
I'm sure it was us who fired first, but it was them that fired the last. Those prisoners that survived were driven out and set free. Now call me coward for all I care, but I hid when fighting got ugly. Came out later looking like another refugee and no one was the wiser. And we never could forge, forgive Gorm what he did to us, though. Yeah, I missed the part where you don't deserve to die. Yeah, me too. I was like, okay, that's a good excuse, Dairene. Alright, alright, I'm getting to that. The cult of Cothon, not a bunch of people you want to cross, obsessed with the blood of some fallen god, or maybe it's just blood in general, they made me an offer. I sabotage the water pump, I get safe haven at their hideouts, get back at Bourbon, find a new home, two birds with one stone, as they say. It wasn't until I attended one of their underground meetings that I realized I was mixing with the wrong crowd. And believe me, I have been affiliated with some pretty twisted indiv individuals before. I ran out of there before they were done with the first initiate. You don't want to know what that entails. I do have one of their keys though, the prize for the mistakes I've made. Let's make a deal, huh? You don't breathe a word of this to Bourbon and I give you my key along with directions. Actually, they're there. Should be plenty of stolen belongings there, ripe for the taking for the likes of you. Don't worry anything funny though. Don't try anything funny though. I keep that key well hidden. Don't want to raise any suspicions now. Yeah, we have a deal. I'm totally going to take that deal. We'll kill him afterwards. A strange key. What do you want? I'll just keep your nose clean. I want to kill him. Let's sell some stuff, and then I'm gonna end the part. Those are pretty good, uh, good pants, but we can't use them, so fuck it. Darren's directions? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oops. Did I sell one of those? Didn't mean to sell that one. Only selling little weapons. And armor. Okay. So you tolerate it. And no, just like in real life. We can actually craft one of those bleeding things now. Let's just try that before I, before I end the part. Got you need to ask. Uh, okay, we've got a serrated spike, spike now. Plus 12% bleeding damage. Granted skills, impaling weapons, granted by item, empower your attacks to pierce through armor. This ability must be targeted to maintain its effect. Piercing damage, pierce damage, okay. I don't know. Uh, whatever, we'll see in the next part. So I can see you guys in the next part. We're level 15, let's put some more points in this. Okay, and um, then let's end the part. I'll see you guys in the next part. Goodbye.